Hello everybody, welcome back. We are on our island today with our multi-level roof and I am not happy with these windows here. They don't work with this part of the house. I think I'm going to do what I did here. Yeah. So let's get rid of these they work on that side but they don't work here they really don't so we're going to go and steal these windows and, and use them because they just don't look right I can probably put them in here. Let's see. I can probably get away with quite a few. I'll add lots and then I can always take. Okay, that's where we have to stop. Now to me that looks a bit better but it doesn't line up, so we're going to have to play with that. But they do sort of echo back to that. So, yes, I think I'm going to do that. But I think we need to try and line them up with this door. That makes more sense. That window. Let's see, these windows are wider. Hmm. Does it look weird? Does it work? Let me know. Should I leave that one in? I think that looks... Better. Obviously, this is a whole new, whole different section. This is the living area, the, the the bedroom section. So I'm not too stressed about that. But I think for this particular area, that works a bit better. So now, last time we built the table. I did go in and just neaten it up a little bit and I also put a cross brace in the middle. I also put in a couple of walls here so you can actually see if we come through here. I sectioned off this area here and we've got a little wall there and then another little wall there so that is our it's a two meter gap there so that's more than enough as far as I'm concerned and this will hide all the stuff that we need to add from both the dining area and from the living room and if we need to we can add another wall here so that's just so that it I, I, I would probably put just straight doors on here I don't know maybe cupboards maybe doors is these are these are hanging cupboard that you can do stuff with and I can't remember which one it is it's got a whole different whole bunch of different applications I saw it in one of the houses I don't know if it's if, if it's just a straight hanging cupboard or if it is in the storage low medium I 
just for the life of me can't remember what it looks like. I'll have to search for it. It's not a wardrobe, it's, it, it's a single cupboard that you can actually stack. Is it this? Take the handles off. Can we take handles off? The game hates it when you go through all the handles. It gets a little twitchy. The knob. if we're going to do a handle we might as well do a handle eh? all right let's see if we go with the painted wood painted wood the handles back it's tiny can we Size it? No, we can't. That's sad. That might be something to look at literally here. I'll stick it on the wall there so we've got it. Right now, my thought process was to actually put in the fridge and all the other stuff here, but we do need. corner unit. I'm not sure. I know we had some interesting corner units. Will that fit in here? No it won't. But it would. Can we make it fit? Let us first of all copy and paste. Then move. If we move it to there, doesn't come through the wall. just gives us that extra corner that we need. I think that'll work. Let's see. Might be wrong, but this is uh, the way to go because it is sorry, thinking hard. This is the house flipper sandbox <laughs> do we need a sink do we want a sink I suppose we do does that line up mm, it does actually works well all right then we need a stove and a fridge. Now I would really like an oven on eye level. Can we do that? I wonder if we can. That lines up, so let's move this out a smidgen so it lines up there. It might look a little weird. I'm just going to have to look a little weird. 
Do we want the oven at the back? Ooh, sorry. <laughs> Wasn't trying to do that to you. Yeah, we can do the ovens at the back. But again, as I say, I would really like an oven at eye level. So maybe we need to get some more of these cabinets. can try uh, duplicate a bit not duplicate the duplicate let's 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 see we need a fridge as well so let's leave a gap for the fridge okay I want to move you No, maybe? I don't know. High level oven? Woo! Not that way. <laughs> that wouldn't be very safe though, would it? To have an eye level oven right on the corner. Somebody gonna get hurt they. Hmm. If I change the top, it will blend in with the kitchen. Hmm. Now we don't have space for a fridge. Unless we put the fridge on the corner here. That covered. Or almost put there. I don't know which the front of the fridge of the cupboard is anymore. Okay. I open it? Okay. Awesome. <laughs> yeah, yes, we are going to use the move tool people. Is what it is. There we go. Actually, it doesn't look bad. Hmm. It just doesn't quite. Oops. Line up there. There's a gap. Doesn't then line up there really well either. Right. Do we move everything forward a smidgen? Third or matches? Maybe. work. Okay, let's see. If you use precise placement, you can match it up. Okay. Why is there a little gap? And then we 
we've got deck a little bit on the corner. Is that a problem? Not if we get a little cupboard and make it fit. jump on top of the cupboard here. Alright, I can do one of two things. I can either put a strip across here of something or I can move them. might have a problem putting stuff on but you know what that is what it is and we can get the glitching on the, the top it does look better sort of that one not quite Okay, let's see. Ah, no, don't do that. No, over. Yeah. Do I want to be this crazy? Just like pass the bullet and put that in there. one piece of the wall out. These are matte cupboards. They are not the Oh you know I'm a chop because we still gotta put a fridge in there. Alright, small home appliances. It's gonna have to be in action. us fridge. Large appliances. Huge. I'm going to have to put that piece of wall back onto it. But yes I am. So funny. That'll teach me. There we go. Obviously, we will make this white. And yes, I'm not a big fan of plastic, but that works. Details. Oh, 
I didn't do that, did I? Made of plastic, right? Interior is fine. It's flat against the wall. Matches up with the cabinets. And now we've got two cabinets that we have left. We can always add to if need be over here. Now, do we need any cupboards? Not a big fan of cupboards. In builds, I'm a huge fan of cupboards in real kitchens. What is on this side? Okay. That's the living room. We can always put some cupboards. Ooh, that's going to be fun. Use these. We take the handles off. And we go with the plain painted wood. So they are matte. in the way. Only a little bit. Okay, let's copy that first. Awesome. And then let's just... Oh, man. The question would be... get another one in. Yes, we can. I think that'll work. Now do we have these cupboards here? Ah, they've got the handles on them. Deeper. It actually doesn't help us at all. Okay, uh, small ones. So those are like they don't line up in any shape or form. That's great. Can they be dredged? No, but you see they don't line up. Okay. Nope. And nope. We need a shelf. These can't be resized. Um, ooh, okay. We're gonna have to move that 
down of it literally just to the top of the bridge there we go you can't make them wider You can make them long. It literally is cutting into the top of the fridge, and I'm okay with that. Okay. I think I am good. I would have liked the eye level oven, but it is what it is. And that doesn't look too bad. Okay. Now, before I put chairs in here, we need to establish. We've we've gone with very neutral colours in here, and I'm not quite sure. to go with maybe something like that we're playing with graphic detail uh, is that crazy just touch frames the room a little bit of interest to the floor Probably put another one. It's a huge room. Purple will work really well with <laughs> the wood, but I think it, it, it just gives something to the whole board. Now, do we put another door and echo the same feel over here, or do we just put windows? I think we just need windows. All right, let's start with that one. windows I keep on hitting E instead of Q Hmm. 
I actually am going to put the windows back and then I'm going to put some artwork on the wall in the middle there unless we put a fireplace doesn't look bad at all. Okay. Let's see what we can find. I tried to get some more pictures. But here's hoping. Hmm, what color are we gonna go? Hmm. Seriously? Ah, there we come. That one would work. That one would work. I like that one, but I think it's too wide. Yeah, it would look good, but no. Maybe this. flowers in my, my, my gallery at the moment. Because it might be autumn here, but it's spring everywhere else. soft very subtle not quite the the the, the color of the floor Probably blue, but it's got the pinks in it which works for me all right now chairs what on earth are we going to put in here as dining chairs i think something like that, or like that, something that's got a bit of statement, so let's start with this. Now we've got the black legs on the table, well, so we'll keep that, and we've got suede. Let's have a look at, at patterns, shall we? Let's start right at the very beginning and what color were we looking at? That, the more purple one, hey. Let's start there, we can always move. Look, we do have florals on the wall, but we can always work with florals I don't like that you can't change the direction of the straps. Sorry, I had to just go there. See those straps, and then those straps go sideways, which irritates me. I like that. I really like that. Okay, let's get a, a few of those. See, that'll work with the floor. We can probably get more than six chairs at this table. Quite comfortably. 
and I'm not going to overload the table. Actually, I might have to because it looks very empty right now. Just put a little bit of space in the middle here. Looks good. I mean, it's a big family. It's three bedrooms to start with already. So we might as well have some fun with it. A really big dining room. The question is, do we keep the stripes white? I think we keep the stripes white. I like the stripes. Awesome. All right, now, next question. Oh, that's, I was like, why is there a line on the wall? I know why there's a line. I have the urge to put either some Ottomans or something in here, but I'm going to walk away from it and decide. I think I'd like to put a, a, a white carpet on the floor, but again, I'm going to walk away from it now because I know I get involved and then I do crazy things. Okay, so we've got a passageway on that side. We've got, I don't know why we're getting these weird lights, but it irritates me. Just have a look here and see where the... Uh, that's beautiful. It's almost like I meant that to happen, hey? <laughs> okay. All right. So, my, my thought process is I'm going to put a half bathroom in here. I'm hoping I've got that... Yay, I do. Okay, awesome. And I can't remember how big it needs to be, so let's find us some bathroom stuff. We need a toilet. Yes, we're going to go with the basics. We can change the color of it. And then we need... A wash basin. Needs to go against the wall, doesn't it? I think something simple like that. If I put it there, it's the same width as the toilet. Put my wall. Let's say that. Where does that take us? Oh no, too big. I think that's more than enough. We will be putting a we want a door. 
here. Maybe we want the door. Yeah. Let me just. I, I cannot figure this out if I can't walk around. ceiling on here. That will be ceiling with stucco. Now we just have to be able to see what the heck. 2.6 Does that hit the toilet? No, it doesn't. You can come in, close the door. And you're good. Okay. I think I'm going to tile this. Maybe. Why am I doing that? How about a white marble? How big is this? It's not bad. Matches with the white porcelain. Do we put a do that every time? Hmm. It's maybe a little high, isn't it? Well, that's a door handle. How high do you want a basin to be? I can never tell. Okay, let's see what options we have. That one. Maybe we should go... marble which will match with the floor and everything we can stay with the black mm -hmm. 
Oh, that looks so synthetic. Okay, we'll just don't we. I don't know if that looks right, but that's black there as well, so that will work. All right. We chose the white. Oh no, this is the white walls. So let's go with the white marble. Seriously? Yeah, that'll work. We need to move this down. Uh, we just need to move this down a smidgen. get onto the yeah I suppose you can and yes I'm going to decorate the bathroom now do we want lights or do we want I wish you had the option to change it interiorly That is with the light switch. We chose this one the last time, didn't we? Yes. So, wire it. I think that's pretty bright enough. Don't know if I like those though. These are really cool, but eh. nah, those will do. All right, stuff. In here we'll go with the softer round. Mm. No what I'm ah, it's the base. We can throw in a little bit of black because 
this bathroom is very light so that'll work and we want a soap dish cleanser I know we have lotion in here somewhere tissue box if they they need something that smells good we have just the thing for them even um, 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 um meeny meeny we'll go with this one Here's a toilet roll somewhere. There we go. Okay, and then I think I would like to put a plant in the corner here. And I know I would like an orchid. Get us a small pot. I think something like that could be fun. They're going to be small enough. I think they're called short. Yes. Very nice. We need something else here. Hmm. All right, let's see what we've got. Very soft bathroom, so I think. are too wide. That would be interesting. Let's concentrate it above the toilet, which is a problem. not centered but it's as good as it's gonna get okay next we need a small 
rug. Do we want a, a wiggly woggly one? Or do we want just a standard? Is this the right one? Yes, it is. Yeah, let's go for this. We'll put a fluffy one in there for our guests. We need something else in here. I don't know what. Maybe a tray. No, it's in here. Is it maybe a, a vase? Yeah, that'll work. Not exactly what I was looking for, but it will do. There's still a blank spot there, but again, walk away. All right. So the pl the point of this is we've now given ourselves a little bit of. this across here a little bit of a gap here Ooh, did I did I yes I did and with that we can actually the room in half a little bit. So I think what I'm going to do here oh <laughs> that didn't work did it? Don't know if I want to play with beams if they're not going to be even. So we'll just say no, move away. All right. So we have a living area, an entrance. I'm not one to get too fussy about the living room and the, in, and the entrance being in the same area. But then here we have, which we could probably, I don't know if I want that covered. All right, we could probably have a little desk area in here. And then a nice area that we can go out into the back garden. Because we do have a bit of a patio here for now but it is subject to change at a moment's notice do you, do you see that and these nice high ceilings now the one thing I'm going to have to do with these nice high ceilings is is my yes it is run this along it so that we actually have the option of putting lights in the center you can't really see it but it's there now in here on the other hand we have a bit of a problem because who knows what we're we going to be able to do with this and this isn't <laughs> it's not exactly centered but it's damn close and I'm not moving all these 52,000 pieces that are on the table here so sorry guys it is what it is but we are going to play with sofas that will be our next step. We just have to decide what so sofa color we want. That's going to be fun. All right, let's see what we've got here. Where are we? 
Great. So now we've got a glass tray because I used that extensively in the bakery. We have this big round tray, which is also very cool. But again, it's not very, unless we do. Hmm. That one is teeny tiny. How big is that one? That one might work. Yeah, we could work with that one. And we know it's not going to fit on the dining room table. Because we made the dining room table. So it's not going to fit in at all. Hmm. Ooh, I'm trying, to, I'm trying to fly. Is that big enough? I don't suppose I can stretch it, can I? I can change it though. Oops, into a white. It'll look quite good. Let's see how much we can fit on this tray. I don't know how they fit each other. Okay, it's not too bad. Some candles would be good. This table is big enough that it can actually live with that nice candle. And as you can see, as soon as I put another surface onto the table, we can place stuff. Is can I put a flower in the veins? Not exactly in the vase, is it? Now it's in the vase. No, it's not in the vase. Why? Probably fit more than one. Should we see? Okay. Do we have other colors? Yes, we do. Very big, but they will do. XYZ X axis.
bet you it's not in the vase. It's not in the vase. only put one flower in the vase. Okay. We might need to do something else. What else do we have that's got a small enough stem? But got a little bit more height. Be better. Okay. Oh no, don't do it. Please don't do it. Don't have the energy for it. Oh, hold on. I think one of these will sit in here. No. Okay, here we go. will work. Perfect. Okay. Now, we need some windows. That goes into the bedroom, so we've got that wall open. We've got this area, which we are going to put a really big sofa and lots of windows into question is, do we use I suppose we should use one of these over here somewhere and over here somewhere we leave that out. I think let's leave that out. Let's put a door in there. The next question would be big windows or the smaller windows that we've got here. Well, I can always turn them just now. space for a television there or do we leave the television for the other room in there I think so what do we have in the way of fireplaces fireplace we only really have three of them at the moment
will probably get away with that. use something else here at the moment. Let's change the style of this. Base is going to be... Okay, that is the base. We can go for the same base, the striped black marble. That is the foot that it stands on. Maybe. Subject to change at any time. Alright, so this is going to be where we get the glitching. So let's go for the black marble. Okay, this is the back of. I'd say let's do that and that in the same. Okay, so this is. Maybe we should do it in a steel. Glitchy, glitchy. Right, what are we doing on the top there? Let's go with stone, marble, no cut pattern. Let's see how much glitch we'll have with that. Way less. A little bit, but that can be fixed. I would like to extend the footprint of that base. Here, it's better. Now it's just the chimney. of a chimney do I want? Oh, damn it. Do I want a chimney sticking out? Do I care about that? No, not really. get this right.
simple, yet effective. Oh. Let's get confused what I'm building. I think that works. What do you say? Now we need a sofa here. Now I'm going to buy a sofa. And place it. Once I've bought the sofa and placed it, I will try and build one. You can see I'm gonna play I'm gonna build it behind this. So I'm gonna put this here. And then build behind it. Because we want something that's a little bit bigger than this. Wish me luck. Now, we can either start with a beam. As the feet. Because. It would work. Either as the side. Yeah, you can see it's the right width. For a sofa, if that makes sense. So, let's choose. Let's go for ebony. to make it a bit bigger because this is definitely not big enough now let's see if I can do that again because you cannot replicate it by just picking up the whole thing Now, what color are we going to do in here? I'm thinking of... Hmm... Maybe a... I don't know where these are. Let up. Could we do that? With... No. Let's do the... The suede, it looks nice and soft. Now we've been playing with the lavenders and lilacs. Maybe we need to play with more lilac blues. As you see, you, you can sort of stick it on here. But we're going to need a few, so let's throw couple around here. The only problem is you can't make it thicker, if that makes sense. You can't make it more poofy, which is unfortunate. But that is pretty much the same width as the sofa. I'm just moving this away a little bit more. But you do want to account for the back of the sofa. Hold on, let me Okay, 
now this sits on top so it first we're going to resize it then we're going to move it more collisions now as soon as you turn it <clears throat> Off the 90 degrees you'll see it does interesting things when you move it like not quite getting in the right position do too badly you can always design furniture if you want a little bit of a kink in the back you can do that arms if you want arms if you don't want arms you don't need arms you can use wood but I'm going to just go for straight arms for now I like to make actually you know what let me take it in there and bring it back there because then when you move it you literally So bring it down if you prefer. And you sort of have a sofa. I mean obviously you can fine tune it. But that works like a bomb. Now if you're happy with that, ooh, if you're happy with that you can duplicate it and then just place it. I'm trying to sell it. Okay, so that is basically what can be done. Obviously, <clears throat> the legs are a little ugly, but that's okay. You can remove them afterwards. And then you have, you can just see them on the side, or you can actually remove everything and put something else down there. Yeah. I quite like that idea, that concept. Now we're going to have two big sofas on each side of the fireplace. And we can literally just put them. Ah, uh, let's do this one at a time. As I say, you can move it up or down. 
as long as they sort of appear, then we're good. Only thing I hate is having to swap between things. Once you've set it up and you've got your sizes, it's very easy to duplicate. And you can always shift it a little bit if you want the back tweaked. you can't move it. Once you've set it down, you can only move it literally piece by piece. How does that look? Not exactly even, but you know what? It is what it is. Uh. Okay, these are going. We can uh, that back looks oh yeah, so let's take it down a bit. I prefer that. I like the colours. The colours make me happy. We can use these colours. And now we can look for some chairs. No chairs, armchairs. No. I like this because it's a nice patio set. I like that a lot. I'm not building armchairs. Maybe just put one of these in the middle for the heck of it. I just wish we had that poofiness. Does that make sense? It's more luscious. I suppose we could... a little bit more luscious but we haven't got that curve to it which is unfortunate but it's okay at least we can do stuff Okay. 
Okay, so it's got a more... Luscious, relaxing feel to it. Now, what color did I do? Okay, that's the color. Let's see. Oh, what am I doing? Okay, let's change this. We'll keep the base black. So this was in the faded section above the purple. Let's find something fun. trying to change that looks quite good well, I don't know it doesn't quite have the glow about it does it That's got the glow to it. Yeah. Okay, some tables would be good. I'm not looking for anything too fancy but I'm looking for something with a little bit of no I really like this but I've used it to death in a lot of my builds uh... glass coffee tables to be honest actually like this one Very big, is it? Right, let's use. Yeah, it's okay. I think a console table behind here would be good. You just can't put a console table. One of these behind a sofa. It won't let you. Okay, 
as I was saying, it won't let you. You see? Well, you know. There are ways. Look how well that fits there. Sort of hovers. It's okay. We can push it into the ground a bit. That's what we will need. There we go. I'm liking it. I'm hoping we can find some something to on the walls but I do know I want a lot of plants in here there we put rose bushes in the house so I don't think cattails would work We do have the option for a lot of tall pots, which is awesome. I mean, look how, how big that pot is. So we can get something really nice in there. It's a very pretty, ah, oh, there it is, very pretty box. Okay, there you go. Now, my thought, oh, what am I doing? Standing. There is a thing, and I've used it before on the front of my shops, and it's this teeniest, tiniest little thing, but. can be stretched. Only one way though. But it also can be moved. But we'll keep it for now. Let's buy two more because once again I'm thinking of design. Let's move it.
No. No. Can be used as beams. Okay. That's the concept. I don't know if, if, if it follows through, but... That's interesting. And that's going to have to be resized up a smidge. There we go. If you look at that, it makes some very interesting yeah. if I go too high, I'll lose that. But you see the squares. Now I can do that with bricks, these ones, or I can do them with what we used for the legs of the table. But I quite enjoy that. They need a few more. Should we select a chandelier for the living room or a number of chandeliers? We can always go multiples. But here I'm thinking these because they're really pretty. Shade. Should we go with a painted wood? That's a fairly neutral. Mm. We're going to put a couple up, so let's take it down to about 50. to shift them but let's stretch them in the meantime how low do we want to go Why does it keep on 
feel like I'm in the same. That looks okay, I think. Just don't like the fact that they are all in a line. So, can we move them? Do they stop shining when you move them? No. That is awesome. Okay. I'm happy. They are a pain that you actually have to... Um... Sorry, I'm trying to move it by just picking it up. That'll teach. Okay. <clears throat> that is over the table. We can probably them down a little bit further. There we go. We can always put something on the walls here as well. We can drop some down from here. Please. I don't know. I'm getting at that to that point where I'm like, I don't know. My clear vision has 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 left me. That'll work. Let's put some plants in here. today. No, I want, I don't want the very tall ones because there's nothing there that really jumps out at me. I think. Yeah. We'll add extra stuff later. Okay, guys, let me know what you think about this. I'm not sure about it. I will have to spend some time thinking. I can either do that or I can just build, like I did in the bathroom here, something like this. I think that actually is a bit more stable and this house is a very solid, sturdy house. So instead of something like soft and squishy, thinner and fra more fragile, I can get away with chunkier. So guys, I hope you enjoyed me furniture building. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you all soon. Bye.